Pressure Monitoring System, or TPMS, on your Hyundai is designed to keep you informed about the pressure of your tires. The tire pressures can be displayed on the LCD display on your Hyundai. Depending on your model, the screen can be found in one of two areas. On most new Hyundai models, the tire pressure screen can be found in the utility screen. On older models, it will be in the driving assist screen. Press the cluster display controls button until it reaches the correct screen. Then scroll through the screens until the tire pressure is displayed. Most new Hyundai models will display the individual pressures for each tire on the vehicle. The system may not display the tire pressure until after a few minutes of driving. You may instead see a drive to display message on the screen. This is normal. After driving for a few minutes, check back on the screen for the pressures. If the system detects a tire that is significantly under deflated, it will alert you. You will also see the low tire pressure warning on the tire pressure LCD display screen. If this happens, you should immediately reduce your speed, avoid hard cornering, and anticipate longer stopping distances. You should stop and check the tires as soon as possible and inflate them to the correct pressure. If needed, use the tire mobility kit if your vehicle is equipped with it. See the Tire Mobility Kit video on the Hyundai YouTube channel and your owner's manual for information on how to use it. If the tire cannot hold air and your vehicle has a spare tire, you should replace the low pressure tire with the spare tire. Also know that the spare tire does not have tire pressure sensors installed and will not display a tire pressure on the LCD display. Instead, when the spare tire is installed, the LCD indicator will flash for one minute and then remain on until the full-size tire and wheel is replaced on the vehicle and operating correctly. And if any of the following happens, please have the TPMS inspected by your Hyundai dealer. The TPMS indicator light does not turn on for three seconds upon vehicle startup. The TPMS malfunction indicator remains lit after blinking for one minute, or the low tire pressure position telltale remains illuminated. In normal conditions, you should inflate the tires to the recommended pressures shown on the vehicle placard or on the driver's door sill. However, large temperature and altitude changes can cause inflation pressure fluctuations. Therefore, it is permissible to add up to three PSI to the recommended tire pressure if you anticipate driving in these situations. Finally, if you need to change the tire pressure values, you can do so. On vehicles with navigation, go to Setup, then General, then Units, and then Tire Pressure. On models without navigation, go to the User Settings on the LCD display, then select Other, and then Units. For more information on these and other features, be sure to consult your owner's manual, available at My Hyundai, or the user's manual, accessible via the touchscreen. And be sure to visit HyundaiHowTos.com, My Hyundai, and the Hyundai USA YouTube channel for more helpful videos for your Hyundai.